Hey everybody and welcome back to Newegg TV. I'm Steve and today I'm going to do an overview and a brief demo of this VPN firewall from Zycel. This is the Zywall 310. Let me stress that this is not a home use firewall. Not to say that you couldn't use it for your home, but this is just far better suited for a business with racks and a server room. For starters, it's very large. 17 by 10 by 1.7 inches and it has four 40 millimeter fans running to keep it cool, which are rather noisy. But they weren't aiming for small or quiet. They were aiming for performance. There are three VPN firewalls in the series, the 110, 310, and 1100. Here's a comparison spec sheet showing the differences of the three models. In an effort to keep this video brief, we're going to concentrate on the 310. There really aren't any accessories with the 310 other than some warranty info, a quick start guide, and rack mounting brackets. On the front we have the reset button, power and system LEDs on the left side, and two USB 2 ports with console port on the right. The 8 gigabit Ethernet ports on the front are completely configurable. Everything from supplying a different subnet or IP range per RJ45 port to which services would be allowed on them. The 310 defaults the P1 and P2 Ethernet ports as two separate WAN connections. Should the main one fail, it will automatically switch over to the backup connection, then switch back after the primary is restored. This gateway supports a maximum of 100,000 concurrent sessions and a new session rate of 8,000. Zycel are utilizing multi-core CPUs to force a ton of packets down the gullet of this firewall. The Stateful Packet Inspection Firewall has a throughput of 2 gigabits per second and a VPN throughput of 500 megabits per second. On the VPN side, the 310 supports SHA2 SecureHash Algorithm 2 to provide safer VPN connection and L2TP Layer 2 Tunneling Protocol VPN for your mobile devices on Android, iOS, and Windows platforms. In addition, this firewall also supports ICSA certified IPsec VPN with a maximum of 200 concurrent IPsec VPN tunnels, as well as AES, 3DS, and DES encryption algorithms and IPsec NAT traversal. If your office needs SSL VPN connectivity, this firewall supports reverse proxy and full tunnel modes, unified policy enforcement, clientless secure remote access, and 50 concurrent SSL VPN users. If you aren't comfortable working on the command line interface, you can always use the web GUI. Zyso likes to use this animated graphic representing the front and rear panels on the firewalls. It's nice if you're having to work remotely and need to describe to someone which cables need to be checked or connected over the phone. Nearly every aspect of the firewall software is customizable. The firewall rules have numerous settings with users, services, IPs, or subnets that can be addressed by groups or single objects. Here's a quick look at the VPN wizard. Using the wizard is helpful if you're not tech savvy or if you just want to walk through on setting up VPN for your users. Okay everyone, thank you so much for watching this video and if you liked what you saw today, don't forget to click the like button and if you haven't already done so, click subscribe to any of our various YouTube channels and we'll see you soon.